Yeah, I know you were tidying up, but I've not even read them and not finished them. Will you do me a favour? Go to the bins, get them out for me, bring them in, and put them back exactly where I left them, please. I only thought they were rubbish. I was only tidying up like Mum told me. Yeah, but if you didn't have a party in the first place, you wouldn't have been having to tidy up and cover your tracks. Are you drunk, Dad? No, I'm not drunk. We only had two beers. I'm just a bit angry with you, Jake. We we'll leave you in a position of trust because you're getting older now. Just trying to be a teenager. Why don't you just let me do that? Jake, look, I apologise. All I want is my magazines back, so go to the bin and dig them out for me and leave them where I left them. Is that all right with you? ta -ra. Love you. Hello? Jake? Have you looked everywhere? Of course I have, Murphy. You think I'm stupid? All right. Searched everywhere, under the carpet, Back of the couch, on the couch, places where I won't put the lottery ticket, my secret drawer, my birthday card drawer, everywhere, you name it, knife box drawer, kitchen, microwave, oven, everything, garage. Have you got a dog? I haven't got a dog. Have you not? Do you want one? No, I don't. Because sometimes if you go to the shop you bought it from and tell them you went in at a certain time and all that, you can verify it. You can tell them what time you went and what you was wearing, what your blood type is and your sexual preference and all that, and they can give them a chance. Are you for real? I told you. Of course, I've done everything. The bloke from the lottery came here, he grilled me for half a day. Of course, I've done it, I've exhausted, I'm sick of it now. It's still summer, Darren, if you don't mind. <laughs> it's the end of summer. It's still summer in my book, Dave, I can dress how I want. Hey, you, I want a word with you right now. Yes. You're fat to be. Are you calling me fatty again? Yeah. You old card, Mark. There'll be no coffee or tea for you. <laughs> God bless. Right, you've got good work and watch the traffic. And I'll bring the parking chicken to you. <laughs> What's been your problem? Oh, what to do with you, Charlie? Sorry, I thought we'd share each other other's problems. Well, tell you, but you promise you don't tell anyone. Promise? I promise I won't tell anyone. You have my word. My wife's left me. Oh, dear. Yeah. Got my boss on the case. I know you don't want to be here, but you're going to be here for two weeks. I need a volunteer. I'm doing my best in this place, trying to set up a new business, and all you can do is moan. You're not working, you're at college, your mum and me are supporting you. And she's working all the hours God send. It's not right. You need to cut yourself on, lad. Look at your CV, Jake. CV? I want to be an actor. I don't want to be working in the day sense for the rest of my life. I want to be a spaceman, but I'm not. I'm flipping looking after this lot here. How many years have you studied in teaching? <laughs> eight. Not that it's anything to do with you. This job of yours, eight years, is doing God's <coughs> dream. Have you finished? Yeah. But have you been eating hot chilies yeah. again? Hey? <laughs> And what do you think, Ian? The art project is absolutely booming a bit crap. Are you always uh, met with such cooperation, John? I don't know, they're, they're rebelling a bit, but I think they're showing off because you got a guest in and I think they were trying to impress you. But I'm at the end of my uh, tether, to be honest. You've been on the job for quite a long time, eight years is long. I think what I might get them doing is something with clay or plasticine. Make it a bit more interesting for them, doing some kind of, um, not, not sure what they're called, statues, busts or something. Sculptures, yeah. Sculptures, yeah. Well, the thing is, it's a daycare centre and social services pay for them to come here and there's only so much you can do so we, we just do artwork I, I can't think of anything else no one gives me any training nobody gives me any direction i'm just left to my own devices to be honest just to get on with it thanks for having me in john it's been very interesting uh, oh not at all definitely at all. valuable data for my research well good luck with your studies thank yeah, you your joy to have around us you can have a sister chris can't you Certainly can. Yeah, I know I can. Yeah. But it would sincerely help you in court if you did come clean with us. Because when this goes to court, it'll help your case if you've told the truth. This isn't going to court. You have no evidence whatsoever. Right, you think? End of. I want to get back together. <laughs> to you. Of course I do. Love you too.